Let's go, ladies. Melly Resendez is our team equipment manager, Hi. but she's so much more. Hi, Melly. Cats, cats. Oh my gosh, how many of you are there? Oh my gosh. Melly's been with the program for over 30 years. Yeah. All right, let's go, ladies. Early on, when I first took the, the job, it was Melly that was like, okay, this is how it works, right? This is what you got to do. Just making sure that I'm moving in the right direction. Melly is truly my compass. Melly is one of the most selfless, caring, funny, and loving people. Here you go. Jones, yes! and, and this ball is... yes! She just gets Northwestern to its core. She understands Northwestern volleyball. She has always been there for every single athlete that's come through. Here we go. Here we go. Go Cats. I'm born and raised in Evanston, Illinois. I was a lifeguard in Evanston, taught swim lessons to probably half the Evanston community. One of my lifeguards was a student athlete here at Northwestern. She comes up to me one day at the pool and she goes, hey, there's a job opening at Northwestern as an athletic equipment manager. I'm like, well, what's that? Next thing I knew, I accepted a position here so I could also work on my degree at the same time. It's probably one of my greatest accomplishments personally to earn my degree here at Northwestern. This past June, I was elected as the very first female athletic equipment manager president. That's why I'm partly doing this, is increase the understanding of what it is we do and the value we bring to our athletic departments. It's the athletic equipment manager's job to manage massive budgets. Helping to design t-shirts and uniforms. I'm not paid to say no. I'm here to make their hopes and dreams come true. And I mean that very sincerely. Ooh, I like this. It's about the swag, right? Thank you. All right. Thank you. Love to play Santa, Santa Melly, and that's your volleyball shoe. The best day is always report day when the girls get all of their brand new gear for the year. <laughs> all right, come on into your uh, area here. Who loves Christmas in August? Who loves Christmas in August? 18's right here. I've got eight. Eight is right there. I'm here to make your hopes and dreams come true. It's about what the girls want. That's what makes me happy and brings me joy. Can't wait to win 10 games and come back for more. I honestly can't imagine that every team has a Melly. She's just a ball of energy, a ball of joy. She is a positive light in every single day. One of the most amazing humans I've ever met. She's always asking how I'm doing, how the team is doing. But in return, I'm able to ask her how the team is doing because she is so in tune with our program. I have a unique opportunity with student athletes to kind of meet them in places where nobody else is seeing them, in the locker room. I'm in there doing work, putting their loops up or putting their uniforms out. And that's when they're kind of most vulnerable and open to things. I reach out to them. It's in my DNA. It's who I am. Last summer, after I came back, after losing my mother, she had went through the same thing a few years back. The first day I came back, she just wrapped me up in her arms, and um, we shared tears together. She told me it's not going to be easy, and. She knows what it's like, and it was good to have someone there that, you know, knew the feeling. I was Megan's age when my mom passed. And there is nothing more life-changing in a singular moment than losing your mother and hearing that news. And my heart immediately blossomed in hopes of capturing her. Oh, good. I'm good. It's go time, baby. 
I'm not gonna make you run more laps. I'm not gonna cut your playing time. I am completely safe. I'm not gonna tell your secrets. So I respect and I understand very intimately what they're going through and I recognize my place in that. The most amazing thing of all is how she pumps them up. The little things she writes on the board, her little Melly pep talk. She always says, vamos gatos, <laughs> and then does the little paw print. It's funny. I can really sense when people are like taking things a little bit too seriously. They're all saying, go cats. I'm like, no, vamonos gatos. Melly is probably everyone's favorite person on campus. She has a sixth sense of knowing when someone needs a little, a little push of happiness. It does feel like I am married to a celebrity. <laughs> crazy like we will uh, we'll be out in public and you can be sure that we'll run into somebody that she knows we can even be in another country walking down a beach in Fiji oh hello uh, yeah, okay. you're good thank you Melly. year after year we get a new crop in you know and uh, she's always learning something new working with perpetual 18 to 22 year olds they make sure that I'm in the right colored blue jeans whether they're baggy or now they're high-waisted you know, just keeps me young. I don't think many equipment managers have that type of relationship with their players. Every year, it's a new recipe. Every year, it's new ingredients. And you never know quite what you're gonna get or how you're gonna get there, but that's the magic in working in college athletics. You come in happy and you leave happier.